Hi and, and welcome. welcome. I'm Aino. And I'm Herman. And we have half an hour of fun lined up for you on Go Grammar Go, specially brought to you by TV Pendidikan. Go Grammar Go will see two teams competing in four grammar games to get the highest points. And these points will be collected in individual as well as a team event. More rules to come, but first, let's meet the contestant who are going to pit their grammar skills, intelligence and speed against each other. And here they are, from Sekolah Menengah Datuk Lokman Kuala Lumpur, we have the green team. And their opponents are the boys in yellow from Sekolah Menengah Kebangsaan Laki-Laki Bukit Bintang, Petaling Jaya. The green team from SMK Datuk Lokman is represented by three lovely young ladies Nurul Balkis binti Ahmad Zakaria Genevieve Olivia Simwen Ling and Sarah Sarang Yusuf Welcome And the yellow team from SMK Laki Laki Bukit Bintang is made up of three equally handsome young men Muhammad Shazni Muhammad Sanjeevan and Shang Jun Hong. Welcome, boys. And to our studio audience and those watching TV Pendidikan right now, welcome to Go Grand Go! Well, I know. Looks like we're going to have a tough competition, aren't we? Mm. Do you think they are ready? Um, they look ready to me. Are you ready, Green Team? Yes, yes we, we are. are. Good. What about you, boys in yellow? We are ready too. Well, very good. Okay. The first game on Go Grammar Go today is called Words in Action. Okay, we are talking about action words. We also call them verbs. Verbs tell us what people, animals, or things do. Verbs can show actions in the past, present, or future. So the green team will start first, and Nuru Balkis, you're the first player. So when you hear the buzzer, you'll have 60 seconds to read, decide on the best answer and drag the answer from the box to complete each of the sentences. Okay, so each correct answer earns you 5 points. Any wrong or unfilled blank gets you no points. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. To the game station, please. Well, no rule. You have completed your question in less than 60 seconds. Well done. Okay, let's look at Nurul's answers and see how she scored on the screen behind us. Well, you have four correct answers and your score now is 20 points. Well done. And that means the green team now has 20 points for the first game. Okay, it's time now for the yellow team to outdo the green team. And for that, we have Muhammad Shazni. Right, Shazni, are you clear about the rules? Yes. So, uh, do you think you can do better? Maybe. You ready? Yes. Okay, to the station, please. Let's look at Let's. Shazni's answer and see how he scored on the screen behind us. Oh, your second question is also wrong. Um, oh. <laughs> only one correct out of five questions. So 
So Shazni, you have only one correct answer and that means that you, your score is five points. So that's the end of round one and the score at this moment is uh, 20, 20 points, points for, for the green, green team, team and five points for yellow team. Congratulations! So contestants, are you ready for the next Go Grammar Go challenge? Yes! Go Grammar Go! go. Alright, for the next game, come on over here. Contestant number two from the yellow team, Sanjeevan. Alright everyone, this is Sanjeevan from the yellow team. Hi Sanjeevan. Hi. Okay. Okay, our next game is simply called Names, Names, Names. Herman, this is going to be a really long explanation. Would you like to do it? Well, you know, I know being the gentleman that I am, I'll let you do it. <laughs> oh, thank you Herman, it's very kind of you. We're talking about nouns. Nouns are the names of people, animals, things or places. And here's what you have to do to win points for your team. I'll read a list of 10 questions to you and in 60 seconds you must try and answer all of them. If you do not know the answer, you say next and I'll move on to the next question. The faster you answer each one of them, the more chances you have of answering all 10 of them. Each Correct answer gets you five points. The buzzer will mark the start and the end of your quest. Okay, is that clear? Yes. So Sanjeevan, are you ready? Yes, I am. Okay, good luck. The national flower of Malaysia is the? Hibiscus. A mechanic repairs a car. Who repairs a water pipe? Plumber. In what month is Christmas celebrated? December. At the market, we buy meat from a butcher. Who, we do, who do we buy fish from? A fishmonger. We call a group of monkeys a troop. What do we call a group of bees? A swarm of bees. Your father's brother's son is your? My cousin. A person who cannot see is blind. A person who cannot talk is? Dumb. Which animal is called the sheep of the desert? A camel. Butter is made from? Milk. Beef is the meat of a cow. What name do we give to the meat of a deer? A venison. Well, you have got all of them correct. Well done. Okay, you got 50 points for your team, so that makes your total score 55 points. So, Genevieve, can you outdo Sanjeevan? I think so. Good, then come on over here. Do you still remember the rules? Yes. I will begin as soon as the buzzer is sounded. Two children born at the same time are called twins. What name do we give to three children born at the same time? Yes. A small river is called a? A baby goat is called a? Yes. Kid. What do we call a baby butterfly? Um, Who repairs our shoes? We call a group of buffaloes a herd. What do we call a group of fish? Fool. Your grandmother's father is your? Great grandfather. People wear socks on their feet. What do they wear on their hands? Gloves. Which animal is called a man's best friend? Dog. Muslim pray in a mosque. Where do Hindus pray? Temple. What season comes after winter? Spring. Well, you've got um, seven correct. Uh, the second answer was stream. The third, caterpillar. And the fourth, cobbler. So you've got seven correct. Uh, 35 points and the total score for your team now is 55 points. Congratulations. Well done. Well, that's the end of round two and it looks like SMK Lucky Lucky Bukit Bintang has 55 points and SMK Dato Klokman also has 55 points. Well done to both teams. Two grammar games down and two more to go. And it's all on Go, go Grammar Go! This is just to remind you that you're watching Go Grammar Go, specially brought to you by TV Pendidikan. Before we go on to the third game, let's look at the prizes for the winner and the runner-up. 
The prizes for this program are Reference Books and Readers sponsored by Pearson Education Longman, Malaysia's Near and Burma, your partner in education. And the hamper sponsored by Nestle Products in Near and Burma, the good food, good life people. The runner-up will also receive books from Pearson Education, Longman Malaysia Syndrome Berhad, and a hamper from Nestle. Okay, I know. Mm -hmm. Shall we move on to the next game? All right, teams. The third game is called Words That Describe. Sarah and Jun Hong. It's your turn, and this is what game three is all about. Each of you will have to look at the pictures on the screen behind you and Unscramble the given letters to form a word to describe the picture. You have to spell the word correctly and say it clearly. You're given only 15 seconds to figure out each visual. The words given to you are either adjectives or adverbs. There are many types of adjective and adverb, but we are looking for the ones that describe the picture only. Okay? okay. So five points will be awarded to your team if you answer if your answer is correct and wrong or incomplete answers get get no points. We'll start with Sarah from the green team. Come on over here, Sarah. So Sarah, are you good with your adverbs and adjectives? Not so bad. Okay, shall we begin? Okay. okay. We'll begin at the sound of the buzzer. Oh, we'll go on to the third one. Okay. Okay, so the first answer is traditional, the second is skillful, and the third is multicolored. And you got the fourth correct, huge, and the last one should have been poisonous. So it means that you have collected five points for your team, and the total score now is 60 points. Congratulations. Well done, Sarah. You may go back, back to your place, place now. And now it's the yellow team's turn, and for that we have Jun Hong. Come on over. Okay. okay are you ready? Yep. Okay, we'll start at the sound of the buzzer. Um, captivating. C A P T I V A T I N G. Well known. W E L L K N O W N. Good. The next Hi. one. <laughs> Tentive. T E N A. Uh, tentative. T N A T. Oh, I missed that one. White. Okay. W H I T E. Okay. okay. Well, you've managed to solve the first one, captivating. The second one, well known. And the last one, white. The third one was supposed to be common, and the fourth one should have been attentive. Well, so you've got 15 points for your team, and the total score now is 70 points. Congratulations. Thank you. And go back now. At the moment, the total score is 70 points for Sekolah Menengah Kebangsaan Laki Bukit Bintang, and 60 points for Sekolah Menengah Kebangsaan Datuk Lokman. Congratulations. Now 
for the final game, this is going to be teamwork. You'll have to put your heads together to solve a crossword puzzle. Okay, this is how it is played. Each team will draw a numbered ball from uh, the ball which will correspond to a number in the crossword. I will then click on the number to reveal the clue for that question. You then have 60 seconds to discuss and decide on the answer and drag the letters from the box on the left of the puzzle to fill in the gaps. A correct answer earns you five points. If your answer is wrong, your opponents get the chance to complete and steal your five points. Okay, are we clear on the rules? Yes. yes. Okay. First, let me get the ball. Yes. It seems the green team is going to start the game. I let the green team, first player of green team, Balkis, to draw the ball from the bull. Don't look. And give the ball to me. Good. And it looks like the green team has picked up number four. And let's look the clue for number four. 60 seconds from now. Come on, girls. Uh, time's up. <laughs> and let's, uh, let, let's see check. whether it is the correct answer. Uh, oh, it's not correct. correct. So, so now we are going to give the yellow team 20 seconds from, from now, now to answer. Okay, we'll okay. accept that. We'll accept Let's check the answer. So oh. the answer is Cree. It's now the yellow, the yellow team, team, I know. Okay, take one. Don't look. Okay, we've got number six. Okay. Okay. See? 60 seconds from now. Discuss among yourself. Okay, you're Are done. Are you sure this is the answer? Okay. Okay, we'll see. It. We'll check your answer. Oh, that's not the correct answer. So, so we'll the green team has a chance to grab the five points from yellow team. And 20 you seconds. Have 20 seconds from, from now. now. One. Oh, oh your 20 seconds is up. up. Look at the answer. For question six, Eastern is the answer. Belonging to the East. Okay, Herman, maybe okay. it's the Greens. Oh, the Green Team. Green Team's turn now. Turn now. <laughs> Stir the ball. Okay, give me the ball. And the Green Team has pick up number two. Okay, let's look at the clue. 60 seconds from, from now.
time is running, girls. You're running out of time. Hurry up. Ah, uh, oh, no, time's, time's up. up. So and your team have the 20 to seconds. Team. Check the answer. Let's look at the answer. Oh, I've got the correct answer for that. Good. Congratulations, Five the yellow points team. For that. Now, oh, yellow team. To the yellow team again, okay. I know. Okay. Who's gonna pick? Four. Okay, number eight. Okay, let's see. Okay. You've got sixty seconds. From now. Strong wind. And the name for strong wind. Yeah. Why didn't you give it a try? Okay. Okay. Is that your answer? We'll check and Wait. see. Oh, that's not oh, the answer. That's not the answer. <laughs> Good try. So okay. We'll give the, the chance, chance to, to the green, green team. team. 20 seconds from now. Okay. Hurry up! 20 seconds only. Okay. Okay. We'll check. Let's check the answer. Either, so let's look at the correct answer. It's Gale. Oh, okay. the green team turn now. The green team turn. Pick one ball. Stir it. Okay. Get the number to me. Well, the green team has picked up number four D. Four down. <laughs> okay. Okay. Sixty seconds from, from now. Now. Extremely unkind. Okay, let's check. So let's check the answer, check the answer. of extremely mm -hmm. unkind. Come on. All right, well done. Let's go back. The yellow team's turn. Okay. Number nine. Okay, let's see what it is. Number nine. Sixty seconds, 60 seconds from, from now. now. Not, Not a, a true, true story. Okay. Let's check, Let's the, answer. check the answer. Oh, well done. That's correct. Let's to the yellow team. Okay. Pick one ball. Okay. And here we go.
we have number three from the green team? Okay, 60 seconds from now. Killed person. Hurry up! Time is running out. So let's okay, check let's the answer. Check. No, that's wrong. That's not correct. 20 so, seconds for the yellow team. Okay, let's check. The answer? Alright, correct. <laughs> On the yellow team's turn. <laughs> oh, okay, number one. Okay, 60 seconds. From, from now. now. Opposite of on. Okay. So we'll check Let's the answer. Check. Team. Carl Pink and it is number seven. Number seven. Okay, sixty seconds from now. One who speaks falsely. Okay. That's very fast. <laughs> Let's check the answer. Oh, correct. <laughs> we'll continue with the yellow team now. Balls. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's see number eleven. Okay. 60 seconds from now. From now. A team. A team. A team. A team. We're running out of time. Oh, oh time's, time's up. up. Green yeah. team, 20 seconds from now. Just want to give it a try. Come on. Your chance to get the five points. Oh, they don't know the answers, so let's look at the correct answer. It's a panel, okay. a team. Now, the green team's okay. turn. The last 